Aloha friends, so here is my smellies. I call them my smellies because these are things that would um, make my home um, smell good, decorate my home, and um, and all that, that stuff. So I'm, I'm going to give you guys a Bath and Body Works haul along with a couple of Scentsy hauls. Now if you guys don't mind, I'm going to go ahead and open up the boxes because they're all separated. And then I'm going to break them down to three different videos because I really want to talk about the warmer of the month. Um, a diffuser that I ordered and then the others are the holiday collection and along with like the the holiday um, scents so I want to separate that into three different categories because I really want to discuss with you the diffuser and why I ordered it and why it's very popular so with that being said I'm gonna go ahead and uh, sit down and show my face see you guys in a bit all right hey I'm back hi I am back. I went ahead and opened up my Scentsy boxes and separated them. So there are only certain ones that I'm going to share with you today. And today I'm going to basically talk about our warmer of the month and then also what I have been melting for the past week or maybe week and a half since I last um, shared with you guys. So let's get started. I'm so excited. Friends, I ordered these about like a week maybe a week ago last Monday and every time you order from Sensi towards the very end of the month towards the very beginning of the month it does take a bit longer than usual because that's when everybody's ordering their stuff in that's when consultants are ordering at the very end of the month because um, as you recall my two Sensi videos ago I, um, I shared with you guys that you don't um, some consultants have a VIP and that's all good there's nothing wrong with that it's just allowing the consultants to order for you but I said that I don't do that um, because and I said that I shared that I I don't normally do that or I haven't done it yet because most of my orders are straight through my website if you order straight through the website it gets to you you pay a little bit of shipping and um, but you get it right away you get it within a couple of days especially if it's like in the mid month um, it, it really delivers really fast but I have been messaged by a couple of my Sensi friends here asking me if I am willing to do a VIP and of course you know of course I can do it for you guys basically what a VIP list is if you like if, when consultants say hey you want to be on my list um, what it deals with is always the um, most of the time, most of the time, when we know that things might sell fast are the warmers of the month. So currently, for the month of October, this is the warmer of the month. There are some warmers, just like the Stargaze warmer. That was warmer of the month back in January. That sold out in hours, hours, with, within, within hours of just like dawn kind of thing. Meaning like, you know, it's available by midnight and between Eastern Time, Central Time, Mountain Time, Pacific Time, all those being said and everybody ordering, they ran out. Um, and I believe the last, for the ones that ordered during that, that few days in January, they had their last shipment in back in May. So that's how far back um, it was for Sensi to be able to deliver. And with that being said, it wasn't Sensi's fault. They just didn't realize how popular the Stargaze warmer would be for customers. Um, but I think they're doing a lot better um, with, with um, I think they're doing a lot better with their items and making sure that they have plenty for the customers. With that being said, like I said, a couple of you guys asked if, if I could open up a VIP. I will certainly do um, open up a VIP. I can talk about that again later on, but I can start it up in either November or December, which just means that with the warmers of the month, it's available by the first of each month. And then I can start taking orders in towards a couple of days before that. So come midnight, I'm there trying to put the um, input the orders in so that you guys don't have to. That was one of um, my customers requests because they said that they were busy. They don't really wanna go in there by midnight or early morning to be able to put those orders to making sure that they get it. Okay, got you. Of course, I can do it for you. Okay, breathe, breathe. It's kind of weird when I film like this because I have my um, 
my camera and then it faces me and I'm actually looking so it's like a mirror. Hi! Aloha! Happy Monday! Happy Monday friends. I'm so happy today because I got my Christmas gifts in. These are gifts for myself. Um, the ones I showed you guys, all my smellies are my early Christmas gifts and it was like it was like Christmas morning waiting for them to arrive, okay? So today is Christmas for me. Happy Christmas, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Gift Receiving for me. All right, let's get started. Okay, so let me go ahead and open special delivery. Like I said, it is our warmer of the month and so excited for that. So taking it out of the package. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Okay, big mistake. I shared with you guys. See, I'm, instead of redoing it, this is I get I get real. This is this is it. Um, it is not special delivery. It is pumpkin delivery. So I kind of gave a little bit away of what my third video will be, which is with my holiday collection. So we'll wait for that, but. October warmer of the month is pumpkin delivery. All right, I'm not gonna redo it, friends, because this is me. This is me making mistakes and letting you guys know. Oops, sorry, sorry. Okay, let me go ahead and open it. Again, package really well. That's why when I open it, I'm like, how is this the pumpkin delivery? It looks like so Christmassy. Pumpkin deliveries has the pumpkin lid. Mm, I cannot wait to do all my unboxing. Okay. First of all, it's packaged really nice. It is an element warmer. So we talked about an element warmer compared to a bulb warmer on my last video. Comes like this. He is he. It's a he. I don't know why. It's a he. Comes with a black cord toggle switch again it's a pretty nice long cord and and there it is it's an element warmer meaning that it's um, the heat comes from a hot plate and here is the the dish part of it there. and length is about a good good size with my hand it's cute. It's a pretty, pretty decent size. Not too big, not too small, just perfect. Underneath, okay, there's the, the hot plate area is here. Now with an element warmer, one of my friends here asked what is the, the wattage that was with my last haul, which was the Black Knight. With all the Sensi element warmers, it comes with an eight watt, 120 voltage, um, temperature as far as the heat plate okay and all right I can't wait to plug this in oh my gosh so cute if you have a boy it's perfect for a boy's room or honestly it's even perfect for like year round and where is my plug I this is my studio this is my happy place this is my quiet place and my children and their friends come and destroy it that's okay at least they're home that's what I always say I don't mind kids coming I love all my children's friends I would rather them have my life chaotic and me complain about it but at least they're home okay I'm plugging that in and then here's the lid oh look at all those cute pumpkins cute pumpkins okay there's the holes right there and that's where your scent will immerse into your home and just make your home smell amazing with all the fall scent. Okay. Now, before I share with you guys, I want you guys to know, before I share anything with you guys, I always research. I always research so that I'm not trying to give you guys the wrong information. And it's supposed to go a certain way, only a certain way. So let me up oh, right there. So how it's supposed to go 
is that it's supposed to have all the the big pumpkins going at a diagonal okay because then it won't move but if you put it other ways it won't it won't fit okay so just just note to self and it has holes on these ends and then these and like I said it's an element warmer so you're gonna put your wax here you're going to turn it on I'm gonna have it on for you guys and you're gonna know it's on because of the tail lights so the tail lights are gonna show red so I don't know if you guys can see that but also check out the headlights oh, so cool. the headlights turns on all right so I like I said I made a mistake when I first um, came on and said that it was the special delivery what happened was last year we had a special delivery warmer and it was a red truck with a Christmas trees coming out that's also still in our holiday collection this year so I'm gonna show you guys that um, that warmer on uh, my two videos from now but for now this is the pumpkin delivery and you know um, you guys know I have my cheat sheet pumpkin delivery system get that nostalgic fresh from the patch feeling with this colorful retro inspired warmer the pumpkins are removable for year-round display so what that means is that you can remove the dish and after the holidays you can go ahead and just display it as is also just to let you know with the special delivery that I am gonna show you guys it is a red truck with Christmas trees you can have those Christmas trees put into this blue truck okay they're in the the lids are interchangeable that's really cool and both of them also have the tail lights and the headlights that light up exact same warmer but different color gorgeous okay warmer of the month and he is current um, regular price at $50 but currently 10% off so going for $45 so worth it okay I've been waiting for this one okay so that is the warmer of the month let's now talk about the scent of the month because I explained to you guys a couple videos ago that um, every month we have a warmer and scent of the month so with those warmers and scent of the month for that particular month they're all 10% off and then after that they're available but just a regular price and then also um, for you guys um, that may not have been aware all our warmers of the month are still available onto the website five months after its release so for instance this particular warmer is released this month October then we have October we have we have October we have November December January February all the way until the end of March to be able to see it onto the website and order it there after the six month that it has been released then it goes away it either goes onto a clearance section if we happen to have any left or they just may not decide to put it onto the clearance section but after the six month it just goes away okay all right <sighs> breathe breathe I cannot wait to show you guys the scent of the month okay scent of the month is pumpkin cinnamon swirl so when they packaged it one of the boxes they left it open like this and as soon as I as soon as I cut into it oh, I can smell it you can smell it oh my gosh you guys know I'm not really into fall scents but I'm loving some of these fall scents I'm gonna order three four five more of these just to have it more year round or just to have it for next fall just in case it doesn't come back because that's the thing with Scentsy, I just bit my tongue. That's the, th that, that th that's the thing, be a lady. That's the thing with Scentsy items. Once they go, they go, and we don't know if they're gonna come back. We, um, so it's, it's a chance to take. And like that red delivery truck, it was available last year. Consultants even like, I hope it comes back, I hope it comes back. So it was so nice that it did come back, but we're, we're never sure. So if you like something, grab it, okay let me go into my cheat sheet because you guys know I cheat I cheat okay I'm gonna smell it first I'm not gonna look though but you know how it takes forever for me to just type because pumpkin swirl 
cinnamon. Okay. We just, hubby and I had a, a date today because, um, it's not showing, because um, it's Columbus Day and he doesn't, he doesn't have work today, but the children had school, so it was just Danica and I. Um, so we went for a lunch date, went to the mall, and then I bought, I bribed them with Cinnabon. I said, okay, if you guys stay out of my way while I film, I'll give you a cinnamon roll. Okay, <laughs> that's just me. And you know what? Everybody's in their room. <laughs> okay, pumpkin cinnamon swirl. Okay, I, I said I wasn't going to read it. No matter how it's described with Scentsy, it is pure goodness. I cannot wait to melt this. Sometimes I say burn, but don't mind me. Of course, you can't burn it because our wax doesn't, doesn't um, evaporate into the air. However amount of wax you put in there, that's the same amount of wax that comes out. But so it doesn't get burned. It gets melted, Diane. Note to self, melted. You guys know, I'm Asian. I don't say things right. That's always my excuse, friends, if you watch my vlog. This smells good. Amazing good. Um, I can smell the caramel and the pumpkin. And when I smell the pumpkin, it's a mix of... It's, it's not like a, like a pumpkin puree. I, I don't know, but it just smells like a... Like, you know what? Like a cinnamon. Like a cinnamon, cinnamon roll. I know I said that with pumpkin roll, but... It just, it just smells good. It has the perfect combination of just that spices that they put in there and the caramel. Not too much cinnamon. I don't smell too much. I smell more of like the sweetness of the caramel rather than the, the cinnamon and the spices of like the fall scent usually comes with cinnamon. Okay. Sensi says, fresh pumpkin garnish with cinnamon stick and a dollop of whipped icing. I think it has caramel. I smell caramel. It didn't say caramel, but I smell it. Because that was the first sniff that I got from that box. Was just It's sweet. It smells not too sweet, but it has that sweetness to it that you don't normally find in like cinnamon. Not like the, um, the scent apples apples and cinnamon stick. That one you can really smell like the, the, the fall spiciness. This one, no. Very um, sweet. But caramel. I, I smell caramel. Okay. So that is the warmer of the month and everything is available for 10% off uh, and scent of the month. And here is it again, just to let you guys see. Perfect, right? Okay. I honestly would pick it up because you can use it year round. You can put it into your men's office, your office, your, your, your studio like mine, which is your woman cave. Hey, I, I think it goes for both gender, men and women. Okay, I like it. It's cute. Cute as can be truck. Okay. Okay. Okay, I had to pause and drink water. So I can just calm down. Sometimes I talk so fast and I'm like, relax. Because I'm always in a hurry. I'm always in a hurry. Like tonight I gotta go to hula in like an hour. So I just wanna get things done. Okay. Um, on this video, I'm going to to link the catalog underneath the um, the description box of um, the catalog to where I created a an app to where you can browse it um, through your computer, um, as, along with the the app for the um, the holiday collection um, brochure. Okay, so you guys instead of just going through the website, because honestly, I'm I'm a touchy feel person, like. I go through the website, but it doesn't tell me like, okay, what scents are for the winter, what scents for their kind of thing. I don't know. I, I have even maneuvered through that. I'm, I'm very anti-technology. I, I like to touch it and feel it and love it. But, um, because the way our catalog is, it's like the new release. All these new releases have never been, no one ever had. So they're brand spanking new. I even note in here of all the scents I like. And then they have like the fall and the winter and the holidays. So if you guys are like that, like I am, then take a look at the flip and then just browse through the catalog and it'll look exactly like how I see it on the catalog. Okay. 
I'm going to show you guys the scents that I've been warming in my home for the past week and a half. And I've been trying, oh, this is how many, how many. I've been trying them out because I really, I don't want to just stock them or just buy them and not, not melt them. See, I didn't say burn. Not melt them. I want to really enjoy them because I like my home smelling, you know, good. But with my warmers and with my with my scents, I don't leave them 24 hours a day. So I turn them on first thing in the morning about 5.30. And then I have, you know, I get ready. The kids are going to the school bus, you know, off to school, whatever. And then it's already smelling up my home. And that's when usually I change it. That's the free time I have once they go into the school bus. I tend to change them if it needs to be changed. Now it depends on which scent that you have and that will depend on how often you will change it. I only do one. Sensi recommends about two. two. Two cubes per warmer. But because I have so many warmers around my home, like in the living room, I have one right by the window and then a couple steps and then I have one, another one. So that's really like within one big space, I have two warmers. So I will put one cube on each. I'm a cheapo, I don't wanna, I love them, I don't want, but I will put two, two if they're like, um, if they're like a low performance um, scent. But a lot of the falls that I've had are really good performance. So one cube is like working really plenty for me. So my go-to is this one, ah, sweet cream spice. I melted this in my bedroom um, for the first time when, with my Black Crush. Oh, they loved it. The kids loved it. They said it smelled like caramel popcorn. They said it smelled like also like the caramel jelly jelly beans. Like, you know, when you go to the, the candy shop at the mall and you scoop out all the different flavors of the jelly beans. And then they have the caramel popcorn one. Caramel and buttered popcorn all rolled into one. This is what this smells like. And... I'm almost done with it like I have one two three four like I said I use one and for one cube in the bedroom I only need one because it's a small space and I don't want it to be too strong I like things in my room that are not too fall like too spices I like them to be clean and refreshing romantic because it is a bedroom um, and I want to keep it that way I have more I have my false scents or strong scents, spices, kind of like the hallway and downstairs, all throughout downstairs to celebrate the season. Jonathan, I asked Jonathan, hey, it's time to change your, your scent for your warmer. He goes, okay, even my 17-year-old loves it. Um, out of all the scent, he picked out this, uh, sweet cream and spice, because he said it smells good, it smells, um, smells like caramel, so he has that in his room right now. And even our hula, Kumu, loved it. Okay, that's really, I'm gonna order more of that, definitely. And then, my other one, my other go-to, I have a couple of go-to, is the pumpkin roll and the apples and apple and cinnamon stick. Both of them awesome, very awesome for the fall season. Pumpkin roll is one of these popular scents with the, um, the consultants and also with the customers from last year. Mmm, gosh, I open it and it smells like pumpkin, uh, baked pumpkin puree, not like the raw pumpkin when you first open it in the jar. It smells like, like baked and it really performed really good too. So I used that a couple times and that one is really um, a favorite too. So I'm going to get a couple more of that. Apples and cinnamon stick. Oh my gosh, I only burnt it twice. It lasted so long. Out of all these, I think this one is the one that had the longest performance. Um, two thumbs up for the performance and two thumbs up for for the scent, the quality of the scent that it um, it came out. Um, I would I would order more of this as well. Um, whenever my customers are ordering, like, hey, what do you what do you think I I should get for the fall? Apple and cinnamon stick is always my number one up there. Okay. Okay. Now. I'm going to talk about, oh, Cider Mill. Cider Mill is all, also another fall scent that I tried out. Strong, um, very fall, nothing negative to say about it. It's another one of those great performance. Um, I think another long lasting performance, great for the fall, okay? So now I'm going to share with you guys a um, couple of other ones that I've had. These are from 
Oh, except for this one. So this one is still brand new. This one came out in um, September. This one is the toasted co uh, toasted coconut amaretto. Now with this one, no, I don't like it. It smelled so good, and I even put a. I, I remember on my new on my new catalog. <laughs> I remember when Danny and I were sniffing it. I I liked it. I, I I liked it with those little testers that I have, and I like it also when. You know when I open it but when I when I melted it once it was melted mm -mm, I just I didn't throw it out it wasn't that bad for me to just waste it and throw it out I, I let it into the the warmer and then two days later after it was I felt like it was done I went ahead and tossed it and I didn't replace it and I only tried out one so to me to me it just had it just had too much of maybe it's that amaretto sent to it um it wasn't musky or anything like that because i don't i don't tend to like musky ones but i don't know if it's just a combination of a toasted coconut and amaretto it just didn't go together so it wasn't my cup of tea but you know it could it could be others but it wasn't mine okay now these three are from the last catalog it is no longer available so it's either discontinued or retired we don't know if it's coming back next um, spring and summer I'm hoping I like them I like them all three of them so I'm hoping they would come back but again with Sensi we don't know we're just hoping let me go with Chris Orchard Air so this one I honestly I honestly thought that they were gonna bring it back because it was in the last years fall and winter catalog and then they brought it over to the spring and summer i feel in my own opinion they should have just skipped that spring and summer and brought it back um for this for this catalog because it is a fall scent it's amazing and um, the performance is great the smell is just amazing it's it's fall it's just the leaves so it's not those spices really um it just it just feels good it feels like okay it is now august or it's september let's get ready for the fall let's just put this in and exactly that's what i did i started um i started melting this towards um the early part or mid part of september and i liked it so i went through four bars because this was brand new when i um when i started melting it okay Another one from last catalog, they no longer have it, and it's a favorite of mine, Coconut Flan. Caramel, sweetness, very, not very sweet, but a sweetness of caramel to it. It's not the same kind of caramel of, like, um, the sweet cream and spice. No, it's more like a baking, like, that's why they say flan. It's more of like a, a baking with eggs, whipped eggs, and a... Uh, and caramel to it so I I hope it comes back for the spring and summer but I honestly thought again like just like the Chris Orchard air it should have been for the fall and winter because it is to me it's a fall fall scent but I like that really a lot so I, I burnt I melted a couple um, cubes of that okay another spring and summer this one perfect for the bathroom and then I also melted this into my bedroom it's currently in my bathroom and bedroom as we speak I melted this after melting the the sweet cream and spice because I like to to mix it um, so that your nose is not grown accustomed to just all the spices so in my bedroom I melted the sweet cream and spice and my nose my nose was so accustomed to just things sweet and romantic and then I wanted to just give it that punch lemon lemon vervana is it vervana and it's just a punch of lemon ah uh, i was worried about it though let me tell you why i don't know if you guys can see with the camera but it has a little bit of, of sweat to it and then also if you guys can see some parts are like green some parts are like mustardly mustardly yellowish green i don't even know if that's a word because mustard is like yellow right but the color the color of it has um deformed i don't know not even a good word for it so what happens is like with all of our waxes when there is an extreme change of humidity or uh, extreme change of temperature your wax will um will tend to swirl around and change discoloration but that doesn't mean that the quality is bad it just means that the wax um the scent the flavor all the all the goodness in there are just 
twirling around and it's making the colors be discolored but the quality is still perfect so i was worried about that because during the summer we had like a really hot 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 summer here some of my wax was melting so don't ever put it in the freezer but i did put it in the the refrigerator downstairs when i had no food in there so if you're gonna put your wax put it into your refrigerator with no other food like if you have an extra refrigerator or put it into your garage i could have just left it in the garage too maybe i could have done that but there was no i i had no issues with it with the refrigerator my husband just puts beer in there so i'm just hoping that when he popped open a beer that's not gonna smell like the wax anyway these are my babies i had to take care of them but the performance is amazing if you want something citrusy and really that big punch of lemon recommend this and i hope it comes back i only have i think two bars of this see this is why this time around i'm like i'm trying out the scent even if it's just once once or twice then at least if i know that i like it then i can order more and if i know if, if i don't like it then i don't need to order more even though it's so popular with everybody because you know i like what i like that doesn't mean that i like what you like or do you like what you like it doesn't mean that you like what i like that's what makes us all big one happy family really good i recommend this if it comes back next spring and summer and my light is changing my I'm, I'm starting to film for you guys but it's right by the window so it is what it is and i hope i look good but um i'm just messing with you guys you guys know i know i don't look good that's why i never show my face but it's all right okay long video i hope it's not super long but all my senses face to face will be a bit longer if then compared it to how i was doing it before of just showing it to you guys because now i can really I can really focus on like the quality and what I really feel about it and show you guys and show how happy I am. Oh my gosh, it's Christmas for me. I can't wait for the other videos, but I'm not gonna peek at the boxes. I'm not gonna open it. I'm gonna wait for you friends, okay? So with that, expect um, today's Monday. I do have a recipe lined up for you guys. It's, um, it's my version of the Porto's Bakery that's very popular, the cheese, the guava and cheese um, strudel. So I'm going to make my version of that. I've made it a couple times. The family loves it. So I'm going to share with you guys that recipe. I have a vlog, one or two vlogs that I'm going to share this week. And then I have a shopping trip that I'm going to share with you guys. And then I'm hoping that I can share, um, I'm hoping that I can share a DIY with you guys as well. So all those are in the works for this week. I hope you guys come back and visit me again. Mahalo!